Hey Griffin, uh, just your thoughts on the game, how it all came about? Uh, nothing but disappointment for me. Uh, we got a lot to learn from, and that's what we're going to do. We're going to learn. We can about your uh, the opening goal for, uh, for this team. It looked, it looked pretty good. You were one of the driving forces behind it. Yeah, I think it's hard to focus on that right now when we give up two goals in the second half to lose the game at home. How do you guys, the team, the coach, the whole staff, race up, the, 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 you know, Mikael and Clark for those two mistakes and push forward? Yeah, let's just keep your head up. I mean, Mikael's been playing fantastic soccer, and he knows it. The coach knows it. The team knows it. And it's just about keeping that head up and, <laughs> and keep moving on. Shit happens. Coach said you were one of the standout players for this team in this big scope tournament. How do you feel to hear that and to continue pushing forward? Yeah, it's great to hear. But once again, it's, it's a tough way to go out. And I think right now that's where the focus is at. Uh, we're going to let it hurt for a day, and then we're going to move on. Yeah, uh, it's a tough one. Tough one to swallow. I um, think we struggled a bit in their build and trying to get pressure on them. Uh, we definitely fell into a bit of a shell, and it's kind of tough for us to get out of that. We kind of just accepted not having the ball instead of kind of taking it on us to try and get it back, and when we got it, really valued that. And then I mean, once the two goals went in, you saw we got some chances. We actually started playing again. So I think that mentality of just – when we don't have it, got to get it back, and we can't settle for that shell and just letting them pepper us. We'll get to the point to go. How did you see it play out when the ball came? Yeah, I mean, I, honestly, I didn't have to do much. It was a great run from Griffin. Uh, saw some space at the back post, and uh, I've talked to Nelson about that spot exactly. So, you know, it's just things we work on in training, working on the field. As a team, how do you guys race, you know, yeah, I mean, it's it's uncharacteristic of them, and I think you won't see them do that again. I think in the game of soccer, like, things happen, and for them, like, it's a bad night, but I don't think that's who they are as players, and I don't think you're going to see that from them. I think they're going to pick themselves up. We're all there for them. We win as a team. We lose as a team, so I don't really want to think about those mistakes. I think there's plenty of things we could have done better to avoid getting into those situations, finishing chances on the other end, lots of other stuff to look at the game. Um, those mistakes aren't going to be things that happen game in, game out. No, no, el grupo está fuerte, está firme. Yo creo que eso es lo más importante, que cuando un compañero se equivoca, todos nos equivocamos. Y bueno, hay, hay que apoyarnos entre nosotros y seguir trabajando. Había mucha ilusión por lo que significaba ganar hoy, eh, la expectativa que había por el partido del viernes. Eh, ¿Cómo asimilar eso? Sí, mucha ilusión por, por lo que veníamos haciendo. Yo creo que veníamos haciendo un muy buen partido. De, por ahí, por el momento, estábamos jugando muy bien y yo creo que eso, eso no afectó más de lo que es la derrota. ¿Y en lo positivo qué les deja este torneo al equipo del año? No, no, mucho, mucho, porque competimos, competimos bien, jugamos bien. Yo creo que, que eso ayuda mucho al grupo. Y el día de hoy apoyó a la afición del Dynamo y veíamos que también te apoyaban a ti y que querían que entraras. ¿Qué sientes cuando ves el público a halagar tu nombre que entres a jugar? Bueno, muy feliz, la verdad que sí. Agradezco mucho a la afición por, por venir a apoyar. Tan, jugamos un poco tarde hoy. Bueno, en, eso no impidió para nada para ellos y eso ayuda muchísimo para nosotros para motivarnos y una vez más pedirle disculpas. Gracias. Gracias.